Welcome to the HP12C video tutorial series, Calculator Basics. Turning the calculator on and off is done with a single key located in the lower left hand corner of the keypad labeled on. A single press will turn on the calculator. Another single press on the on key will power down the calculator. Let's start with clearing the display and the more comprehensive clearing the display and registers. More about memory registers in a moment. Numbers that may be stored in the memory registers are not cleared and remain in memory when the calculator is powered down. In order to clear the display, a single key press of the CLX key will do. To clear all the memory registers, press the orange F key followed by the CLX key. The HP12C works very differently from the standard four function pocket calculator you may have hidden in a desk drawer. This device uses RPN entry. RPN is an acronym for Reverse Polish Notation, which works well in specialized applications such as finance and some scientific computation. To work, it uses a system of four memory registers called the stack. The stack holds numbers so that the arithmetic and mathematical function can be executed. The pros of using RPN is that the need for parentheses is eliminated and in most cases there are fewer keystrokes for the same calculation as compared to a standard calculator. The cons are it takes a little getting used to. Let's start with a simple example. Let's sum the numbers 4 and 5. On a standard calculator we would press the keys 4, the plus symbol, the 5 key and then hit the enter or equals key. On the HP 12C the operation of adding numbers is done after the numbers are entered. Try this on your own calculator right here, right now. To find the sum of 4 and 5, press the 4 key, then press the large Enter key. Press 5, followed by the plus key. Now the display reads 9. Let's try a calculation that has more than one operation. Clear the display with the CLX key. Let's do this calculation. 10 plus 4 times 12 minus 3. From order of operations, multiplication needs to come first. We key in 4, enter 12, times key, 10 plus key, and then 3 minus key. Notice you do not need to press the enter key after every number. As a final example, let's look at doing a percentage calculation. Let's say you're buying a computer for $2,150 with a 10% discount and 6.5% sales tax. What's the final amount? Start by pressing the CLX key. Enter 2,150, enter 10% key, minus key, then 6.5% key, plus key, $2,060.78. Notice in all the calculations done so far, all digits displayed are shown to two decimal places by default. The HP12C will round the displayed value, which works well for calculations that involve money. But what if you need to see those extra decimal places? Suppose we need to see the decimal value of one-eighth of a percent. Begin with pressing CLX. Follow with this sequence. First, let's find 1 8th. 1, enter, 8, division key. The display reads 0.13, and that is a rounded value. Let's increase to 3 digits. Press the orange F key, and then the 3 on the keypad. This increases the display to 3-digit accuracy. Next, we will divide this by 100, to get the percentage. Key in 100 followed by the division key. At this point we see 0 0.001 in the display which again is a rounded value and we need two more decimals of accuracy. Let's increase the display digits from 3 to 5 by pressing the orange key followed by the 5 key and there you are the correct decimal equivalent of one-eighth of one percent. 
To set the display back to two decimals, press the orange F key and then the 2 key. The display in this particular example still looks like three digits. Press the CLX key. Last basic item to cover, the battery. Do not be caught without a fresh battery in a high stakes exam. The HP12C models manufactured since 2015 use a single lithium battery cell size CR2032. It can be easily removed and replaced without tools by sliding up the battery cover, lifting out the cell, and inserting a new cell with the plus side up.